Hey girls, I am back with a Dollar Tree haul. My last video was my Dollarama haul. If you have not watched that video, make sure you watch it. Let me adjust my camera. Okay, I had to adjust my camera because uh, it tends to try and focus on this plant by here. Like it'll bypass me <laughs> and go straight for that green plant. I don't know if it just, I don't know what it is, but it always focuses on that. So I just had to move it away. So it'll focus on me. So I do have a few things to show you all. I have my Dollar Tree bag right here. I am gonna get started. Um, before we get started, actually, I do wanna say, before we start, make sure you take just a second here. I'll give you a few seconds. I'm even gonna put a good little music for a couple seconds because I want you to go ahead and uh, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, go ahead, I'll give, you, I'll give you a few moments. Okay, starting with the first thing I'm grabbing out of the bag, I got this Clean Logic Dual Texture Exfoliating Body Scrubber. This is definitely not Dollar Tree brand. This is by, I don't know who, Clean Logic, but it looks like something that definitely would have been at Walmart. And um, these are so good. This is my third one. I think they're starting to. I think they probably got an overstock or something because it's not something they're gonna continue, continuously get. And I'm starting to not see them anymore and they lather up so good. And it is really a good body scrubber. So I couldn't really find it anymore. I saw this lone one by itself, so I picked that up. If you see those, grab them, they're so good. And then I, uh, because it's summer and I'm gonna be showing my legs and stuff, I got this nail brush and I did not get it for my nails. I got it for um, my legs and stuff. I'll use it to exfoliate my legs, try and scrub off dead skin and um, to reveal smoother, shinier skin. Anyway, so it comes with the two different sizes and we'll give that a try. I've never used this on my legs, but hopefully it has a good, the brushes aren't too harsh but they're good enough to give you a good scrub on your leg. So that is why I got those. And then I got this hair dye comb. So you're supposed to put the product in here and you're supposed to like do the little pump. So when you're combing your hair, the product will come out through here. Now I didn't get this for dye, for dye to dye my hair. I got this because when I either not, this ain't, this ain't gonna comb my natural hair, okay? <laughs> but. For extensions, um, sometimes I want to put some conditioner or water through the extensions so I can put a mixture in here and when I'm combing through my extensions, instead of having a spray bottle spraying and then combing, I can just like spray it while I'm combing, like a one stop shop, one step process. <laughs> so I pick one of those up. If I like it, I will get more. So I just wanna try that out. I got this rain poncho, it's just a Canadian rain poncho. Uh, I like buying these ponchos for when I go to theme parks and you get on a water ride and you wanna protect your clothes. That it, these are good for that. And then, oh my God, so, so, you know how Dollar Tree, they'll get like name brand food and stuff. Well, they got the wheat thins and this is the tomato, sun-dried tomato and basil. Listen to me. I don't like tomatoes. Like whenever I order a um, burger or anything or a sandwich, I tell them no tomatoes. But I like tomato flavor. These are so freaking good. They're so good. Like the seasoning, it's like, I feel like when I'm eating it, I'm eating garlic bread. It's so good. The seasoning's so good on this. Um, so if you can find this at your regular store, at your Dollar Tree, Tell them Keila sent you because the tomato and basil, amazing, so good. And then I got the pillows everyone's been hauling. I got the sage green one, I got the white one, and I got the pretty pink one. It's so pretty. So I got the other two. I, I'm not sure what I was going, what I'm going to do with them just yet. And usually I don't make purchases like that. I don't make purchases without knowing what I'm gonna use it for because I end up wasting money. Like, and I'm not about wasting a coin, okay? 
but I got the pink one so when I travel you know how you have the neck pillow sometimes you need an extra pillow like the neck pillow is not enough you need like an extra lift so I got this to go like in my carry-on bag when I'm traveling and I got this cute baby blanket to match so I do have like um, a larger size blanket that I take with me on the airplane because I've been cold on the airplane and I'm like no never again and sometimes that look one blanket is not enough so I got like this extra baby one because it's not too big but it'll give you a little bit of extra warmth if you need it and I thought like the little oh it's pretty with the yellow and the rainbows and the little pillow I just thought that was a gorgeous combination so I have those for traveling purposes um it could also be good for your car if you're taking like a road trip and someone's driving and you want to get in the back seat and have a pillow to rest your head these are perfect car pillows oh um, just an idea and then <laughs> I got these pretty oh my god they're so pretty they're by recollections and they are bows I got these um I'm gonna try some things with them, but they're just so freaking pretty. Oh my God, I love the colors. They're amazing. And then I got this Tivoli foot mask. Um, I just did, you know, I said I usually go once a season to get my toes done, but I did them myself. Like I gave myself a really good pedicure and um, I'm probably gonna use this tonight. So just to like give myself that extra boost of a spy experience on my toes, like they're already painted, but I'm going to just put this on my feet tonight and um, hydrate my feet. And then I got this LA Colors Finishing Powder and Tan. The ones that I've been using are a loose powder and I never have anything like when I go out to blot with, like a touch of them, like girl. So when I saw this at Dollar Tree, I just got it. So if I'm out and I just need a little bit of a touch up, I can use this to um, just, you know, make my makeup look fresh again. And then I also got <clears throat> these metallic pony beads they look like this but girl y'all know these just beads we used to wear as kids like your mama braid your hair put the beads on your hair so um i like gold in my hair during the summertime especially and i plan on like putting like two braids in the front and i'm gonna put some beads on them like some festival type stuff i don't think we're gonna be having festivals this summer in canada I don't know, I, I doubt anything like that happens, but I don't know, I'm still gonna do some cute hairstyle. Make sure you follow me on Instagram to see that. And then I have a box, a box of stuff here. So, um, I needed some more face wipes. These are the spa scriptions. Anti-aging wipes, these are nothing to write home about. They're not very good, but if you mix it with some micellar water, you know they're not bad and I'm running out of the ones I had so I just picked these up and I gotta have hand lotion in the car I can't I cannot stand my hands being dry and ashy so I got this little cute baby Vaseline intensive care I just thought it was so adorable and I mean it's name brand it's not going to be like the Dollar Tree watery watered down hand lotion this is a good name brand and this is something I can keep in the car that my boyfriend can use as well. Like it's not girly scented or anything. It's kind of a neutral scent for the both of us. I don't know if my camera's focusing, but. And then I got some socks. I, I told myself, girl, don't you get no socks, but these are so cute. Ah, especially these with the avocados. I've been eating avocado toast every morning and I was like, I gotta get the avocado socks, they're so cute. And then these, because you all know, I am a student. I am a full-time worker and I bartend or part-time. And I just thought for my part-time job, these beer socks, they're just too cool. So yeah, I got those. And um, almost rounding down, I got the, oh, these are so pretty. These are the exact color of those Nicki Minaj um, Crocs that she broke the internet with. 
Oh, I love them. I feel like I want to bling these out too. Like these aren't crocs, but you can, I can still do some stuff to them. Like hot glue a bunch of stuff on this. I don't know. I got these um, like run to the corner store, run to the mailbox, run to the store type shoes. But oh, they're so pink. I love it. And then um, I got some Instagram pictures. These, not Instagram pictures, Instagram shades. These aren't going to be, um, hold on, sorry. These are not going to be summer shades. I told you all I'm not buying no more shades. But I thought these would be so cute for some Instagram pictures. They're just a big sunflower. I want to try them on because they, they're all tied down. They had some like sunflower ones or daisy ones or something like that. But I just got the bright pink ones. And these will look so cute for some Insta, Insta photos. Let's see if I can get them on. Oh my God, these are big and crazy. Oh God, these look crazy. They can work like this maybe. Oh, they'll work for like a hair thing. Oh, that's cute. See? We'll see. But they're mainly for photos. I could also use them like as a prop, like if I'm doing like a flat lay or lay flat, whatever you say it. These can be used for that as well. Ah! If I don't break them before, <laughs> before I even get to use them. And then, um, I got another Canadian luggage tag. Like I love these things. And so I just pick up one here and there. And the very last thing, oh my God, oh my God, like Shanine. These crock pot original slow cooker barbecue pulled pork packets. Listen, Whew. let me show you first. They look like this, right? I had saw these at Dollar Tree. I had bought one. This was like a couple months ago. And I love pulled pork. Like, like I said, I have been staying away from meat. I'll eat meat here and there. Um, but I haven't stayed away from it. But I do love me some pulled pork. Anyway, so I saw this. I have a crock pot that I've never used that I got from a thrift store for like less than a dollar. So I was like, I want some pulled pork. I bought a, a pork roast or some type of pork. And then I put it in the crock pot with this, all of the things you tell, it tells you to put in there. Some of my own seasonings, because I'm from the South, I know about barbecue. I let that thing cook. Listen, it was so tender, so good, that I went back and I got two more. And my boyfriend don't even like pork, but he was like, that was a banging. It, these, oh my God. So good. And um, I bought, they had a chicken one. So I recently cooked that with some chicken thighs and that was banging too. And so I went back and they had the pot roast one. So I picked up the pot roast one. Um, so I'm probably gonna buy some kind of beef roast something. And this is the next one I'm gonna cook. But um, these crock pot cookers, listen, I mean, for me, I still think you need to doctor up your own stuff and put some of your own seasoning. But even if you don't with that pulled pork one, mm, amazing. So that was everything in my haul. I hope you all enjoyed. Make, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for my next video. And of course, I love chatting with you all uh, in the comment section. All right, I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.